Colorado's most expensive wildfire two years ago tomorrow. The Waldo Canyon fire started. In the days that followed, it would take two lives and more than 300 homes. The Mountain Shadows neighborhood on the west side of Colorado Springs was devastated by the fire. Cardio News Channel 13's Emily Allen reports a new community that's grown from the ashes. She joins us live from the neighborhood tonight. Emily. Jonathan and Katie, I was in this neighborhood last May. When I was here, there was a lot of vacant lots and a lot of homes that still needed to be rebuilt. Now, almost two years after the Waldo Canyon fire, this neighborhood is almost completely restored. This really captures what it felt like for all of us, I think, you know. Memories of the Waldo Canyon fire will never leave this neighborhood. But from the ashes come hope and new homes. So it was worth the pain of going through the building process and you know, living in an apartment and all the things that go along with that. But mm -hmm. it's good to be back. Mike Mortensen and his next door neighbors lost everything in the Waldo Canyon fire. And it brought us all closer as a community here. You know, a lot of neighbors I didn't know before the fire, and and now, um, you know, we're really close. There's still a lot of new construction in this neighborhood. About 80 percent of the almost 200 homes in this subdivision were destroyed during the Waldo Canyon fire. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of support there with neighbors. We've we've really appreciated that. Carol Duddles lives next door to Mortensen. She's reminded almost weekly of the fire. I've talked to our neighbors, and they say the same thing. Pretty much. Weekly, there's things that come up. You just you reach for it and think, oh, <laughs> we don't have that anymore. It took her family almost a year and a half to move back into the neighborhood. So being able to come back to a really beautiful home was awesome. Twelve-year-old Anna Rottenborn's family also lives on the street. She still thinks about her old home. And I know that sounds kind of silly, but I miss the grass. I miss the full-grown trees. Um, that's one of the things I most miss. But she says her new home is definitely better than the one she left behind. It's a lot more beautiful and spacious. It's awesome. These trees still bear the scars of the Waldo Canyon fire, but in their shadows, a new neighborhood has taken root. The Waldo Canyon fire is still Colorado's most expensive wildfire on record. It totaled $350 million in insurance claims. In Colorado Springs, Emily Allen Cardio, News Channel 13. Emily, thank you.